you are graphing rectangle ABCD in the coordinate plane. The following are three of the vertices of the rectangle, and they give us the coordinates. What are the coordinates of point D? All right, well, a good place to start. Let's just plot these, the three vertices that they give us. So it looks like they're all in the first quadrant, so I'm going to focus my, my coordinate axes on the first quadrant. So that's going to be my y-axis. And let me now, put, that's going to be my x-axis. And let's see, the highest x value that I have, you have a 2, I have a 5, I have a 5. It looks like it goes up to 5. So I could say 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So that's 5. I can just know 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And let's see, the highest y value, I have 1, 1, and a 6. So it goes up to 6. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Can number them. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Now let's plot the points. So let's first plot point A, which is at two, comma, one. X equals two, Y is equal to one. So that's that point right over there. Now let's plot point B. Point B is at five, comma, one. So X equals five, Y is equal to one. That's right over there. Now let's plot point C. Point C, I need to find another color here. Point C is that x is equal to 5, y is equal to 6. x is equal to 5, y is equal to 6. So it sticks us uh, roughly right over there. And so we need to figure out what D is going to be. Well, D is going, this is a rectangle. The sides are parallel, all the vertices. We have right angles at all the vertices. So point D is going to have the same, the same x coordinate as this point right over here. So it's going to have the same x coordinate. So, as, so it's going to have an x coordinate. So let me write this. D is going to have an x coordinate of 2. And it's going to have the same y coordinate as this point up here. So it's going to have a y coordinate of 6. Of 6. So D is going to be at the point 2, comma 6. And you see when we do that, we have set up a nice, a nice rectangle here. And we can draw the rectangle. So that's one side. That's the top side. That's another side another side, and then we have that just like that. There you go, we have our rectangle, but most importantly, we answered our question, what are the coordinates of point D? All right.